Yes, uh, Mr. Speaker, I'm happy to yield two minutes to the gentleman from Ohio, Mr. Stivers, a veteran of Operation Iraqi Freedom. The gentleman uh, from Ohio is recognized for two minutes. Thank you. I'd like to thank the gentleman for yielding, and I'd like to thank my colleague from Minnesota, Mr. Walls, for his help as we've tried to enact the Higher at Home Act, which has been rolled into this bill. The legislation came from a roundtable in my district of veterans last fall, and as veterans return home today with military training they've received, that training is not recognized by civilian authorities and states, and therefore they're forced to go through redundant training to do the job they were doing in the military. However, if somebody can do a job while serving in a war zone, they can certainly do that same job at home in a safe environment. And with so many ve veterans returning home from Iraq and Afghanistan, we need to make sure we can do everything we can to help get them back to work. It's shameful that the unemployment rate among veterans, post-9-11 veterans, is 12.7 percent, according to the, a recent report of the Bureau of Labor Statistics. That's why we introduced the Higher at Home Act. It will, as Representative Walls said, remove barriers in front of these soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines, and get them the civilian certifications they need to get them to work as soon as they get home. Uh, it forces states to do this by ensuring that in order to uh, receive certain grants, uh, workforce development grants, they have to streamline these certifications. Uh, I would like to thank all those who have helped make this bill happen today, Representative Walls, Representative Bill Rockus, Representative Miller, Representative Stetsman, and I'd like to thank Senator Pryor for his interest in the Senate. I'd like to call on the United States Senate to pass this bill as soon as we get it done. I'd like to thank the members of this body for their support and urge all the members to support this legislation. I yield back. Gentleman yields back. Ge gentleman yields back. Gentleman.